أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله ثم الصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وعلى أهله وأصحابه ومن استنى بسنته إلى يوم الدين أمين ما جاء بذات السيستاد الإسلام أبيش وبسيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته We welcome you to another session of our free nakhum and soulful class organized by Al-Madrasha to Al-Humsha and today we'll be continuing from where we left off in our book, Nahwu al-Wadih, book 3. So we'll be continuing with the topic, Isnaadu al-Madi al-Nakisi ila dhamayi al-Rafi al-Barza. Isnaadu al-Madi attaching past tense verbs al-Nakisi that are defective, that are ending with defective alphabet. Ila dhamayi al-Rafi al-Barza to our dhamayi al-Rafi al-Barza. So uh, um, in our last class, we explained to us what our Bermayin Rofin al is. We told you that there are those um, pronouns that usually occur in the position of Rofin. Mm. And um, we made some exceptions because of the topic that we are looking at. We said we are looking at only the pronouns that are al-Mutasila bil al the ones that are attached to verbs only. So in that class, we mentioned uh, some pronouns to us. We mentioned Nunu Niswa, we mentioned Tabu Taharrika, we mentioned Na Adal Latwa Al Al Fain, we mentioned Ali Fulish name, we also mentioned Wabu Jama. There was a sixth um, Domir that we mentioned, which is Yawul Mukhotob, Yawul Mukhotob, but we are not using it here because our topic is relating only to Filul Madi. So and we know that Yahweh Mukhotoba is related to Philul Mudori. So that is why it is not, we are not seeing it on the board. So we are concentrating on only these five. The ones that are used, the Domiru Nurofi, that are used with what? With Philul Madi. So that is that on that. Then we now move to this side of the table where we have examples of some verbs that end with um, alphabet that is. We know that our weak alphabet, there are three of them. Alif, Wow, and Ya. So we see examples here. We have Rodia, which is a Philo Madi, and it is ending with the weak letter Ya. Here we also have Sarwa, ending with the weak alphabet Wa. We have Da'a, Kobo, Ishtaro. Da'a is ending with Alif. Kobo is also ending with Alif. That Alif is called Aliful Maksuro. It's shortened Alif. Aliful Maksuro. So people usually confuse. This aliful maksura with a ya because they are both written similarly. However, we should note that whenever we see this, it is aliful maksura. How do we identify it? Number one, ya usually has a dot underneath it, but aliful maksura doesn't. Secondly, is that aliful maksura is always preceded by a fatha. So the way we have it here in Kobo, we see that this thing is preceded by a fatha. We have ishtaro, it is preceded by a fatha. So we that both of them are not having dots like we have in Rodia here. So that's how we identify Aliful Maksura. Please, Aliful Maksura is distinct from Ya. Let us not confuse that. So, Kobo, it is ending with an Alif, not a Ya. Ishtaro, it is also ending with an Alif, not a Ya. So, those are the uh, examples that we'll be using for our explanation today. Now, also, up here we have uh, our domiru rough, uh, our domiru roughing. No, no, niswa. We know that in our fin normal fin modi table, whenever we want to attach no, no, niswa to a verb, the last alphabet preceding that uh, that is the alphabet that is originally ending the um, fin modi. When we want to add, attach um, no, no, niswa to it, it will take a sukun. So that is why we have sukun written here to indicate what the last alphabet should normally take. In normal circumstances, that is where we don't have defective alphabets. For example, when you say Jalasa, Jalasna, same thing, Taumutaharika, it is always preceded by Sukun, Jalasu, Na, Jalasna, so it is always preceded by Sukun. Then for Aliful is name, when we want to attach it to a film, Madi, it is always preceded by a Fatha. So for example, Jalasa, then for what with Jama, it is always preceded by Doma, for example, Jalasu. So we are just mentioning all of those two um, as a guide because it will serve as a guide in the class. Let us leave it at that. So now, 
Rodia. We want to attach Rodia to any of these five, um, what is it called? The more the middle of our friends. Uh, okay, you, you will see that we mention this theory first. This theory, we see that Nunu Niswa is taking Fatha, Ta is taking Haroka, so no is also taking Haroka. Because they are the Domayu Rafa and Barida that was Mutaharika. While Ali Fuli is in a Wau Jama, they, they are Sakina. That is, they don't take any alphabet, they don't take any Haroka rather. So that is why we distinguish them. We deliberately mention the ones that are Mutaharika before the ones that are Saki. Now, so Rodia, once you attach Rodia to um, the Domayu Rafa, how do you go about it? First of all, we should uh, understand the principles behind them. For Nunu Niswa, Ta Mutaharika, Na Adala Tual al that is the one that are Mutaharik, the ones that are Mutaharika. Whenever we want to attach them to a female Madi that is defective, and the alphabet ending it is either a Yao or a Wow. We want to attach it to a female Madi that is not kiss, and it is ending with what? A not kiss of Yao or what? Wow. What we do is, this alphabet, this Rodia Sarwa, or the weak alphabet comes the same way, but it will be taking what? A Sukun. That is, we still maintain this same alphabet that is there. So, for example, Rodia, we want to attach Nunu Niswa to it. Rodia, we know that the Yao is going to take what? Sukun, because that's what um, the alphabet preceding Nunu Niswa is take. So, it becomes what? Ro, our God. Our ya, then we now say that what? Our ya is going to be taking sukun. So, what is God taking before? It is taking kesro. So, it still maintains that kesro. We are not changing anything. We are, only give, we are, we are just establishing the sukun on the word the ya, which is the normal thing that we should do for, for a, um, a sohi verb, like jalata, jalasna. Are we following? So, Rodia becomes what? Rodina. It only becomes an alphabet of elongation because this Yao mod is treated by what? Kesro. So, Rodia, Rodina. The same thing when we attach to anyone that is Mutaharika, it still maintains the normal way. For the ones that, for the verbs that are um, ending with Yao or Wow, that is the defective alphabet is Yao or a Wow. So, Rodia becomes what? When we attach it to um, Tao Mutaharika, it becomes Rodisu. We know this is very popular, Rodisu, although we don't need to add the Sukun on it because it's an alphabet of elongation, but let's just leave it there. Rodisu. We wish to say Rodisu be like Robba. So this is it. This is how it is, it is coined. Rodisu is from what? Rodia. Rodisu. I am pleased. Then now uh, becomes what? Rodina. Rodina, same thing with Sarua. Like I said, for the ones that the effective of our here ending with either wa or ya. The normal transformation takes place, nothing is changing. So Sarua becomes what? Saru. So you only change this fat hat to a sukun. And because the wa is preceded by a doma, it automatically becomes an alphabet of what elongation. You know that uh, wow is always elongated by what? Doma. So, so ya is always elongated by Kesro. So, Saruna, this becomes what? Sarutu. Then, this becomes what? Saruna. So, that is that is ya and wa. They are both what? Straightforward. That cover is taro, the defective alphabet that are ending with, yeah, with Ali. They are also somewhat straightforward. However, there's something that we should note. Whenever we see an Alif and an alpha, a film body that is ending with an Alif, either a straight Alif or a shortened Alif, that is Alif in Maksura, we should note that that Alif is not the original weak alphabet that is there. There is another weak alphabet. The, the real weak alphabet is going to play out when we convert this film Madi to what? To either a Mudori or when we bring out its, its most doubt. I believe we, we, we should have known this before. So, Da, for example, the film Mudori of Da is what? Yedeun. 
So from our film, Mudori, we know that, oh, this Alif is not the real weak alphabet. The real weak alphabet is what? Is the wow. Kobo is the com. Kobo is the film, Mudori is what? Yeah, could be. So in our Mudori, we see the Yao playing out. So we know that our Yao is what? Is our original weak alphabet. So having said that, whenever we want to attach a defective, a, a film body that is not kiss, and it's not kiss is with what? We are seeing an alif there. Whenever we want to attach it to a domori roughing that is mutaharika, a domori roughing that is not mutaharika, we are still going to give this domori roughing what? A sukun. But when we are attaching it to this there, it is the real weak alphabet that is there that is going to what? Come into play. So say for example, why is the weak alphabet that is Hidden in this alif, it is what? It is a wow. So when we want to bring it here, we are not going to write alif again. We'll bring out the real weak alphabet. So because what? Damn. The wow comes. The wow is not from, it's not, it's not here by magic. It is the root word that is there, the word that is, that is, that this alif is representing. So in the modori, it comes out here. Damn, and we said that what the the alphabet is going to take suku, just like in our normal um case with Numiswa. So it becomes what? Da auna. Da auna. Then this will become what? Same thing. Da au tu. This score. This becomes what? Da auna. Then cover becomes cover becomes what? Why the weak alphabet? The weak alphabet is what is the yeah. Cowboy. So the yeah comes in, into play. Cowboy na. Then this becomes what? Cowboy two. Cowboy two. Then this becomes what? Of boy na now how about this now okay I forgot to mention that for our weak alphabets that are ending with Ali I was a, a quick clue for us to identify the uh, alphabet that that Ali is actually representing is when we look at the Ali if the Ali is standing straight like this in, in the film of Mali, that the Ali is straight it is not a, an Ali from Sura. The film of Mudori should be a wow. That is so, like, for example, Dan should be here, there, and when it is written like this, yeah, it's uh, like Alif al Mansura, the film of Mudori should add the word, a yaw. Then that's for three lettered alphabet. For alphabets that are beyond three letters, maybe for Rubai, for Masi, or Sudati, it is always a word, a yaw. So for Ishtaro, Ishtaro, I don't need to look for anything. I know that this is Ishtaro, the Mudori should be what? Yeshteri. So in this, the ya will come into play and it becomes what? Ish Saroy. Oh, sorry, this is me, Nisha. Ish Saroyna. Ish Saroyna. Then we also have what? Ish Saroy too. Okay, let me use another towel with a harika. So we'll not be thinking. Tadomotu is the only town with a harika we have. Ishtaroita. So Ishtaroita only was you bought, right? Then Ishtaroina we bought. Ishtaroina. So that is that on that. So we now move to the uh, Domoyo Ruffin Albariza that was. The Asakina, the ones that are usually um that, that are usually taking sukun. Now, for Aliful is name, Aliful is name, like we know in the film Madi, or normal case uh, verb, verbs that are not defective. The Aliful is name is always preceded by what? A fatha. So for the in the case of Yao and Wa, it still comes into what into play. That fatha that it is taking, that is the, the fatha that the defective alphabet is taking. We still remain just like the normal case, like Jalasa, Jalasa. So Rodia becomes what? Rodia. So we still maintain our what? Our Alif. 
then maybe this is too long. Let me write it. Rodia. 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 Then, for a while, remember we still was, we still maintain uh, what is it called? The the article's name will make it to take, we let it retain its part A. So nothing is changing. So Sarua becomes what? Sarua. Now, for Alif, uh, defective alphabets that are ending with Alif, the, uh, what is it called? The word, the original um, root word that is there, the original defective letter that is that the alif is um, covering or that the alif is facing come into play. So for that, we know that the root, the original Greek alphabet here, the original defective alphabet here is what is the wow. So the wow comes into play, then da becomes what da wa. Da wa then for cover it becomes what? Over ya. Then for each star of it becomes what? Ish. Taro ya. So that is that on Ali for his names. Quite straightforward as well. Now we now move to the last one, Wawel Jama, which has a little bit more of um, technicality. Not too technical, but still it is not as straightforward as the rest. So for Wawel Jama, now please let's listen closely. For Wawel Jama, whenever you are called, called adding um, a, a, a domain of roughing, uh, uh, whenever you are adding Wawel Jama to a, a film of that is Narcis, the first thing that you do is that what? The weak alphabet must be erased. We must eliminate the weak alphabet away. So, say for example, I want to add this rod I want to add this wow with the amount of words, the rod This yaw that is ending, I must what? It must disappear. This wow that is there, it must disappear. The alif that is there must also what? Disappear. Cover everything. All the weak letter must be erased. When we are adding wow with the amount to it. Now, so. Let's let's see that. So for Rodia. Raw and bond. We've eliminated our weak um, alphabet, which is yeah, meaning that the next thing that will be coming after is what is the wow. So uh we know that wow is mutahar, it is not going to take any alphabet. Now normally the word is called wow is jama is always preceded by what? By Zuma. So that Dhamma is still going to what, come into play. So Rodia will become what? Rodu. Rodia becomes what? Rodu. Same thing in Sarwa. We are going to clean our wake up about this one. It's not going to be there again. So we have Sympathia Sa Ro Dhamma. Add our, okay, don't let me add the Dhamma yet. Add our Wow Jama. Wow Jama will force what is preceding, preceding to take what? So because what Saru. So this is the case for Yao and what? Wow. We can probably that ending with Yao and Wow. For Alif, it is quite different. So you, everything is somewhat straightforward. The only ones that usually have issues or much talk are the Alif. The we can probably that are ending with Alif and the um the when we are attaching them to Wow with Jama. Those are the ones that are somewhat technical, but if you follow, you see that it is quite easy. Now, so that now I want to add a weak alphabet that is ending with Alif. I want to add it with what was Jama. Well, we said that we are going to erase our weak alphabet away. So this da will remain what just da fatia da and I fatia da. So let me see da. Now I want to add wow to it. Normally, while Jama should force our eye to take what? Doma. While Jama should force our eye to take what? 
no more, but it can because this is a weak alphabet that is ending with what with Alif. So our Alif, our, our Fatha that is on the um, that is preceding the weak alphabet will be remade. The Fatha on this and what now. So I hope we get that. Nothing is technical. The only thing that we just said is that what. Why would Jama? Because this is an a, is a weak alphabet that is ending with what with Ali. Why would Jama cannot force it to take what no more? Rather, the fat her that is originally preceding that weak alphabet to the remain. Then uh, why would Jama not would not put a, a no more wrong? Ajo wa u jama. Wa u jama cannot force this guy to take what no more. So it becomes what? Ishtaro. Ishtaro. So you check there are plenty of verses of the Quran that cite um, some of these words as examples. So now let's read the coin that in our book and we round up for tonight. So uh, our coin that, I believe we all know the book that we are using, Nahul Wadi, the book theory. So our coin that reads that. Our point reads, he said, Is a Usnida, is a Usnida al Madi and Narkis, is a Usnida al Madi and Narkis, is a Madi and Narkis, is a Usnida al Madi and Narkis, is a Wawa with Jama, one wants to bring, wants to do is not of Madi that is Narkis, these defective verbs, they want to attach them to what? To a Wawa with what? A Wawa with Jama. The point that says that what? Who's if a Haruful Rinla? That is this weak alphabet, they call them Haruful Rinla, but what's what? Erase them. The weak alphabets will be erased. Why Baki Yatil Fat Hatu Kobla Lwa will Jama is a kana mahzufu alpha. He said that the fat hada is before the wah will jama. In the case of a word, a mahzuf that is alif. That is no, we said that we are going to erase the weak alphabet. So when the weak alphabet that you are erasing is a word, is an alif. The fat hat that is preceding that weak alphabet is going to what? It's going to remain. The way we have it here. Then what, what does it matter? Wadum mama kobla ha is a lamia kun alphan. But in the case where what you are erasing is not an alif, that is whether it is a ya or a wow. What is what? Preceding that wow or ya, that is the alphabet that is now the, the last alphabet. After we have erased this weak letter, we will not take what? We force it to take what? Doma. So it's the same thing that we have explained. That's what the coin that is saying. So when we erase the, the first thing for what Jama, he erase the weak alphabet. After erasing the weak alphabet, if what is ending is a word, is an alif. What is erased is what is an alif. Then your last second to last alphabet will remain with what fat ha. So then the word Jama takes its sukun. But if it is not an alif, kulibas was kul and dumma makobla. What is preceding to take what? So that's the first coin that. The second coin that is, is a kind of akhirul madi and nakis ya and that when the, um, okay, is a kind of akhirul madi and nakis ya and awawan. When the last alphabet of a film madi that is nakis is either a ya or a wow, wa usni da ila wairil wa we mean of bomari. And when we now attack, what happens? We are not going to change anything. That is, we do the conversion the same way we do conversion for Nunu Niswa, Harukana, Dalat, Alfine, and Alif Nisnei. That is, the alphabet, the Haraka that is preceding them will remain the way it used to be. If it is not Niswa or Tam, Taharika or Nunu, Dalat, Alfine, it remains with what? With Sukun. Well, if it is Alif Nisnei, it remains with what? Fatha. So for only weak alphabet ending with what? Yao and wow, and attached to any of the domain we were free, except for what? Wow and Jama. I hope we are not making it technical. The um, the last alphabet of a film is what? Is a, is, is not, a, a Nokia's film Madi is an alif. What happens? Wa usni da ila wairi wa we mean of domain. And we attach it to anything apart from what? Wow and Jama. Which, which means that we are talking about this part of the table. Only this part of the table. So, what is the idea? Why is the women of Bomai, Rofi, and Bariza? For in kind of Lassian, if it is a three lettered alphabet, root that is Alifu, Ila Aslia. We are going to convert this 
Alif, this weak alphabet, this weak Alif that is there. I'll go back to what? Street, original root word. So if it is a straight Alif, you know the root word is always what? Wow. If it is a, um, a Alif in the mouth, the, the root word is usually what? Yeah. So they say, root that Ila what? Ila as Ila. We return that Alif back to what? To its absolute, to its root. In this one, in this situation, are we following? Why in Zada Allah has Allah starting? And if it is what? Beyond three lettered alphabet that we with the explanation of the coinda and with our own explanation before reading the coinda, we would understand and we have also simplified the topic for us. So let's look at the ancilla that we have there. We have Hoshi to Rob B. Hoshi is from what? Hoshi ya feared. Hoshi to Hoshi ya feared. So Hoshi to Rob B. So the similitude of Hoshiya here is what? Rodiya. So like I can say, Rodi to be La. I am pleased with Allah. So Hoshi to Rodi, I feared what? I feared my Lord. Sharou to be judge the Sharou, I'm sorry, Sarou to be judge So Sarou to is from what? Sarua, what we have here. Sarua. So Sarua means what? So, so sorry, Sarutu. Sarutu, not Sarutu. Saru, I got mistaken with what I have in the book. So, Sarutu. Sarutu. Sarutu means what? I became honored. I was. I became what? Honored. Saru was for somebody to become honored. So, Sarutu, I become honored with that the true was to my grandfather. Probably my grandfather is somebody of, um, of a good lineage. He has a, uh, a good nursery. So, by virtue of my grandfather, I became what? I became honorable. I became honored. Then, the how to Ahi, the ah, the how to Ahi. I called what? I called my brother. Then, Mother is to free Toriki. Mother is to this is this, so Mother is the equivalent of Kodo. It is a, a weak alphabet that is ending with Alif and Mansura. Alif and Mansura is also what? Alif. So, Mother is to free Toriki. Mother is to free Toriki. So, Mother is to mean. I passed, I passed by, or I passed the Torik in my path. Torik, P A T H, a path, a, a pathway. Then we also have Istad Aitu. Istad Aitu, Sohibi. Istad Aitu is from what? Istad, Istad, Istad Aitu, Istad Aitu, Istad Aitu, Nam. So Istad Aitu, Istad Aitu, for the notes and, uh, Subhanakallah wa bihamdik nashhadu an la ilaha 